Chapter 5 Plants are friends. Key points Types of plants Climatic conditions Uses of plants Some unusual plants Dad, this place looks so beautiful. Who made these plants? Plants and trees are all natural things. There are many kinds of plants on the earth. They are our friends. We see different types of plants all around us. They are very useful for us as we get many things from them. Plants are living things but they cannot move from one place to another like animals and humans do. They stay fixed at one place. Like us, they also require food to grow but they can make their own food with the help of air, water and sunlight. Types of Plants there are several types of plants. They have different shapes and sizes. We can categorize plants into different groups depending on their stems. Very small plants with soft, green stems and leaves are called herbs. They are seasonal plants and live only for one season. Grass, mint, coriander and spinach are the examples of herbs. Small plants with thin, woody stems are called shrubs. They have several branches which grow very close to the ground. They are also called bushes. They can lie for a few years. Hibiscus, jasmine, rose, cotton and henna are the examples of shrubs. Big, tall and strong plants are called trees. They have a thick, hard and woody stem called the trunk. Trunk is covered with a thick skin called the bark. Trees have many branches and deep roots. Trees can lie for many years. People, neem, palm, apple, mango and coconut are the examples of trees. The plants which have weak stems and need some support to stand straight and grow are called climbers. Grapevine, bean, pea plant and money plant are the examples of climbers. Some plants have very weak stems that grow along the ground. As they have big fruits, they cannot stand erect. They are called creepers. Pumpkin, muskmelon, watermelon, gourd and cucumber are the examples of creepers. Let's go an extra mile. The banana plant does not have a woody stem. Hence, it is the world's largest herb. The banana fruit is very nutritious and easy to digest. Desert plants have thick fleshy stems and thorn-like leaves. Climatic conditions The necessary conditions required for plants to grow are sunlight, air, water and soil. We can find plants almost at every place on the earth. We can find them on mountains, in plains, deserts and water bodies. Every type of plant cannot grow in every place. They require soil and favorable climatic conditions to grow properly. Some plants grow in water. They are called water plants or aquatic plants. Hyacinth, lotus, water lily and duckweed are aquatic plants. Some plants are best suited to grow in deserts as they need very hot and dry climate with very little rainfall. Cactus and date palm are desert plants. Plants like ephyra. Willow and spruce need very cold conditions to grow well. They mostly grow on mountains as they have suitable cold conditions. Teak and mahogany grow well in hot and wet conditions. Uses of plants Plants are our green friends. They are helpful to us in many ways. They make the air clean and fresh. They give us oxygen to breathe. When plants prepare their food, they take up carbon dioxide from the air and give out oxygen. Oxygen is necessary for our survival and for animals. Most of our food comes from plants. We get vegetables, fruits, pulses, cereals, spices, tea, coffee, sugar and oils from them. Fiber of some plants is used to make cloth. Cotton cloth is made from cotton plants. Fiber from jute and coconut is also used to make many useful things like ropes, bags and mats. Wood of plants is used to make furniture. Wood from trees like teak, shisham and oak is considered good to make doors, windows and carts. 
Bamboo plant and several other grasses are used to make paper. Beetroot, henna and indigo plants are used to make dyes. Different kinds of medicines are made from the plants like neem, ginger, mint, eucalyptus and tulsi. We get rubber from the bark of a rubber tree. Perfume is made from the flowers of different plants like rose and jasmine. Plants provide shelter to different animals like monkeys, squirrels and birds. Some plants were not originally grown in our country. They have been brought here from other countries and now grown here. Lychee originally comes from China and is now grown in India too. In the same way, Kino is originally from California. Some unusual plants. Moles and mushrooms are non-green plants. They grow on dead and decaying plants and animals. They help in clearing the earth from dead organisms. Some plants such as Venus flytrap, sundew and pitcher plant eat insects to fulfill their nutritional needs. They are called insectivorous plants. Cascuta and Mizalto are parasitic plants. They grow on the stems of other plants and get the required nutrients. New words Herb, a small plant with a soft and thin green stem. Shrub, a plant with thin, woody stems that branch very close to the ground. Creeper, a plant with very weak stems that grow along the ground. Climber, a plant with weak stems that need support to stand straight and grow. Shelter, a place to protect oneself from the weather and enemies. Elder talk. We should not cut trees but protect them. They keep our environment clean. Read and recall. Plants are natural, living things that cannot move from one place to another. There are different kinds of plants all around the earth such as herbs, shrubs, trees, climbers and creepers. Plants growing in water are called aquatic plants. Plants growing in deserts are called desert plants. Different plants grow in different climatic conditions. Plants are very useful for us.